quick tutorial for Tuni. Uh, when you first log into the platform, you will see this Generate Tracks section. You can generate tracks by clicking any num number of genre and mood combination filters. And these filters will generate as many tracks as you like. You can keep clicking on them uh, over and over again, and it'll generate new results, three tracks at a time. You can audition the tracks this way. If you don't like certain tracks, you can use the delete button and clean up your workspace. Now down here on the right, you have the edit button, which brings up the edit bay. You have the favorite button, which allows you to favorite the track and save it to your favorites, which you can find here. You can purchase the track if you are on a free plan. You can add the track to a video. And then in the more area, you can download the tracks as an MP3 or a WAV. You can also download stems. You can share the track even with people who don't have access to Tuni. It's a public link. And you can add to a playlist, which um, will save here in your playlists area. When you find a track that you like, for example, I like this track. You can open up the edit bay, and here you can edit the length of the track. So the track is a minute 30 or 90 seconds right now. You can move it up to three minutes. And if you have a paid plan, you can move it all the way up to 15 minutes. Remember, any change you make, you have to save so that you can re-render a new audio file. The other thing that you can do is you can edit where the drop happens. So you can edit the placement of the drop anywhere along the timeline. And again, once you move this, you have to save changes for it to take effect. Down here, you can edit instruments by either changing the melody or the drums, or by deleting the melody, the drums, the chords, or the bass. And finally, you can add any of these tracks to a video by clicking the Add to Video button. This will bring up the video editor. You can play the video this way. You can restart the video. You can mute or lower the audio in your actual video file. This is the volume for the music being added by Tuni. Um, you can see that the current track is a minute 30, but the video I've uploaded is almost two minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and extend the length to two minutes. And I'm also going to move the drop and now this slider will actually sync with the video on screen. And I'm gonna put the drop right where this guy is jumping out of the airplane. I click Save Changes. This will re-render the track by reassembling it for the custom time and uh, drop timing. And there you have it. Enjoy the platform. If you have any questions, please email us at hello at tuni.io, and we hope that you have fun. If you have any feedback for us, please use the feedback tab here. Enjoy!